Hello and a very warm welcome to Sora of Source classes. Today's tutorial will be on GMAT. We will focus on the quantitative section and we'll try and solve them. So we will begin our tutorial with this question number three. Question or question number marked as three. The question says, what is the value of this for a value of x that equals to 0.6? Okay, so let's find out this. Now, we just need to substitute the value x is equal to 0.6 here in the equation itself. So, let's do it. So, the equation 3 into 0 0.6 because it, since it's a square, we will multiply 0 0.6 with 0 0.6 less we have 1.8 and it is followed by an x. So, it is into 0 0.6 plus 0 0.3. If you simplify this, you will get 1.08 less 1.08 plus 0 0.3. You will get the answer to be 0 0.3. So, the answer will be option number C for this case. Now, let us move on to the next question. The next question we are going to solve is question number 4. Let's read the question first. The question says, over a three-week period, price of an ounce of gold is increased by 24%. Mark it, since it is not given here, but I still, I should include this. There's a difference between increase by 25% and there is with, and the difference between increase to 20, 25%. This means so if the initial value is 100, then it increases by 25%. That means that the final is 125. And if the value is increases to 25%, that means it the increase, the final value obtained is 25. So that is just by changing the words here, by and to, there is a lot of difference. Okay, so but just be careful when you're dealing with questions. Okay, so here it is by 25% in the first week, then it decreased by 20% in the following week, and then increased by 5%. So there is a lot of things happening to this price of gold. It is like increasing, decreasing, increasing, decreasing, something like this. So if you compare it with this line, so it goes on. In the third week. Now if the price of the gold was G dollar per ounce. So this, if this is the initially the price of the three weeks. What was the price in terms of G at the end of the three weeks. So we need to compute this. So let's do it. Now at the end of the first week. So we will do it in parts. Okay. So, if you look at just at the first part of the first week information, it has increased by a value of 25%. Let me insert a page so it will be more helpful. Okay. So, it increases by 25%. So, the price, this is at the end of first week, becomes... 1.25 I'm not writing in percentage okay into G so this becomes 1.25 G okay next the second so at the end of second week it will be 0, 0.0 1.25 g why i'm writing 0 0.8 it is just because it has re reduced by 20 percent okay that's so if you reduce 0 0.2 from 1 you will get 0. Uh, 0.8 you get 0 0.8 and that's why after reduction by 20%, now the value becomes 0 0.8 of this value. So, it becomes actually G, equal to G. Okay? And at the end of the third week, 
the price was the price has increased by 5% so if 1 is the total you have to increase it by 5% so you have to add 0.5 to this okay you have to add 5% to this so it becomes 1.05 into g so this become 1.05 g this is the value or the price of gold at the end of the th third week that means the correct answer to this particular question will be answer number C. So with this we wind up today's tutorial. If you find any kind of difficulty or if you have any kind of doubt then you can call or whatsapp us on this number. We are always there to help you and thank you so much for watching.